Well, bring you a quick update on an item I purchased for the electric chopper build. Uh, I needed to do a custom battery for it. It follows along the same as the one I've already built, only I wanted it in a case. Searching the web, there's a whole lot of different batteries that you can buy here and there. It's in plastic wrap, but I wanted to put one in a little bit more of a case. So looking around, I could not find it in a 14S 8P like I originally have, but since I had ordered 100 18650s from Battery Hookup, I'm going to build a pack specifically for the chopper anyway. So the closest thing I could find was a battery box in a 14 by 6. It does cut, I mean, obviously it shipped in a little bit cleaner than this, but I ended up using it for a template to be able to do frame modifications on the chopper. So it's a bit dirty. It does come to you clean. That's not the seller. It does come with a rubber O-ring of sorts that you put in it. So that way it kind of seals it from the elements. And then as you can see, it does come with the battery holders in a 14 by six that are actually staggered. So instead of them just being straight across from one another, like the other square ones that you find on eBay, this one is actually staggered. So it saves, going 14 wide, it saves almost two and a half cells of space. So it would still be another good chunk longer if you were to do a standard square by square. So you get the top and the bottom, you get some screws, and you get a little plastic handle. I probably wouldn't rely on that too much. It's not very thick, just a little bitty tabs. It does come out at the end of it with two holes, so that way you can get your wires out of it. And I assume that you would put one handle in there, oops, one handle in it, and then when the top goes on, it would hold the other side. Uh, again, I probably wouldn't trust that at all, but we'll put it in there, we'll find out. Once you uh, get your batteries in there, it does go a certain way, as there's little notches, so that way it goes in there only one direction. It will not go the other way. I'm assuming the reason for this is, is that some of the pictures I've seen show it with enough room for a BMS if you run one. Obviously, you get it built, if I can figure out how to build it. Put them all in there, get your wires run out the end of it, put your six screws on it, and then you have a nice 14S 6P box that will end up going back in the electric chopper. Obviously, I've got, oh, looks like I've got one that just finished up. I've got these last six cells out of the hundred to test, and then uh, I'll be able to start building on the actual battery itself. But I will uh, put a link in the description at the bottom so where I got it from. I am working with the seller to try and get just the staggered tops and bottoms. So that way there is more than just the square four by fives or however. Um, and also I'm working with the seller to try and get more configurations than a 14 by six, maybe a 14 by eight or 12s, 10s, etc. Just as long as there's more of these single builds. And then you can actually buy it based on what you want instead of having to link them together. Um, also note that this did come with nickel strips to actually uh, solder or sonic weld or battery weld, I should say, to the tops and bottoms. I'm not gonna use those. I'm actually gonna follow more along the Tesla patterns and do individual cells. Uh, that build will be in another video. I'll actually sit down and do the build of this entire battery. But just wanted to sit down, maybe get a quick moment while these other cells are finishing up. And then later on, you will get the video of the build itself and see how it works. So as they usually say, since it's a channel, tune in, subscribe, and uh, we'll see you in the next one.